so I have to say, these, these last couple of movies that I've seen, you know, Anyone But You actually ended up being one of my favorite movies. Oh, shit, dude, thank you. And I saw this at 10. <laughs> so I want to start with that. What, are you excited to finally fucking watch this movie with a crowd? Because you never got to see it with a crowd? Honestly, that's the thing. Is like Rick and I talked about this movie... Every step of the way, we were like, where's the audience? How are they engaging with movie, this movie? How are they finding it funny? How are they finding it thrilling? Where are they? And the thing about it is, I've gotten to watch this in an edit room, editing room. Rick and I have talked about it. He would call me after Venice. He'd call me after Toronto, New York, London. He's like, dude, they're really digging it. Everything's great. And, and so I'm just really excited to experience that ride because for me, that's what making movies is about. It's about how people... Can, you know how, how audiences really embrace a movie where they are emotionally and how to go on that ride with them and that's my favorite part about movies is is to be next to a stranger experiencing that ride with them together so like for me tonight especially Sundance I've never been here um, it's a festival I wanted to be at my entire life so to be with you know my friend and, and hero Richard Linklater is pretty cool Awesome. Um, one of the things that I, I love about all of your work is your your chemistry with your co-stars. Oh, thank you. What is the what is the, the, the Glenn secret sauce for that? No, seriously. I yeah, like every person you just like have it. Yeah. It's instantaneous. What is it? How do you do it? You know, I, I look. I, I think chemistry is a is a hard thing to kind of boil down because it really comes down to. Uh, it's a, it's a variable that it either is or it isn't, and I and I find that I've really had the great fortune and the great luck to to work with you know leading ladies that are are as down to play ball as I am, and there's a level of trust there, there's a level of collaboration and safety, and just a level of fun. And I think making movies is fun, and I think every single co-star I've gotten a chance to work with is knows that a set is about play, and when you feel safe in another person's hands, that. When they fall, like they're not going to judge you or make fun of you. I think that's the essence of a, a great collaboration and relationship. You know. Speaking of collaboration, I know this is the last question. Yeah. Just wanted to ask about writing, the writing process yeah. with Richard. Um, it is such a sharp script, such a funny script. Yeah, thank you. Um, what was that like? What is that process like? Were you, is it very close knit, or do you do a draft? He does a draft. How does it work? You know, we, it would be different. We we outline this movie together, uh, very very detailed. So by the time we actually end up writing the script, I would just take a sequence he would take a sequence I'd take a sequence just um, and then we'd bring them together on final draft collaborate and we just sort of massage the script together um, but really this was the most effortless writing process I've ever had you know I've, I've had the good fortune to write write a few this is the first produced screenplay I've had but this was um, a joy every step of the way so it, when you're working with a friend and someone who's as smart as, as Rick and who's a veteran of the of this business who's made some of my favorite movies um, it's just never a bad day. I was constantly learning. You know? Yeah. Well, thank you so very much. Oh, it was very nice. Yeah, thank you for saying all those nice things.